Now, tonight, yes, my mum and I are actually going to go head to head with our apple puddings. And you know all about my campaign about getting women back in the kitchen? Well, the first woman I ever saw in the kitchen was my mum. And for some bizarre reason, yes, against my 21 years' experience in a professional kitchen, she still reckons that her apple pudding is better than mine. Just a woman's thing? A woman's thing? Well, um, I'm going to wish you good luck, because I think you're going to need it. How long is it going to take? You need it. 20 minutes. 20 minutes. I'll see you in the oven, right? OK. Good luck, and no spying. Now, Mum, what's it like being in my kitchen as opposed to yours? Not much different. No? Don't you think mine's a little bit cleaner? No, it is not. Don't be so cheeky. So there's no set recipe to yours then, right? No. I used to make it at least once a week when you were a little boy. Right. I'm actually doing an ease pudding, a bit of a classic ease pudding. We're peeling these Braeburn apples. We're going to cut the apples into quarters and then actually caramelise them in a little bit of butter. Once they're caramelised in a bit of butter, got rid of the water out of the apple, we're going to sort of delays with some Calvados. Uh, Mum. Yes? How are you doing? I'm fine. Do you want your hand? <laughs> no. Let's see what you're doing. Um, in there I've got my currants, yeah. Here I've got my apples. I've just peeled the apples. I'm going to take out the cores. Then I'm going to... Well, I don't want you looking at too much, yeah? No. No, yeah, no, well, otherwise, in case you start getting why, a little bit more... Why have you done this? And why is almonds there? Look, is that almonds? Yeah, yeah. Uh, almonds. I'm going to put the almonds on top. Do you know the traditional recipe for Eve's pudding hasn't Go got your fruit soaked in it? And it hasn't got almonds? Uh, no, I, what I'm trying to do, Mum, is a bit of a modern-day version, do you know what I mean? Huh? Not the kind of thing you'd take down the bingo hall. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with taking you down the bingo hall. Look. <laughs> what is this? This is an old <laughs> Delia Smith's recipe <laughs> of Eve's pudding. Right, yes. She Delia hasn't... doesn't put any whole alcohol on her fruit. No, okay. And she doesn't use fruit, it's just apples and a sponge. Okay, well, normally Delia saves her alcohol for half time. Is that not too high? No, it's not too high, Mum. That's fine. The fire alarm will go off. Dear, oh dear. It's nice to have you back in the kitchen again. Yeah, it's nice working together, Gordon. Yeah? Yeah. Don't get used to it, cos it's not happening again. No, I know. Yeah, all right, good. All right, tell me what you're doing in yours. I'm just going to stew mine. Pastry um, you've put at the bottom of the dish. Will that work? Of course it does. Yeah, all right, I'm just asking. Don't get arsy. <laughs> dear, oh dear. You don't have to swear. No. And we pour this mixture on top of the apples and bake in the oven for about 12 to 15 minutes. But before we put it in the oven, we get some um, almonds, some icing sugar, dust it, so as it starts to bake in the oven, it caramelises with really nice almond texture on top. Right, Mum, how are you doing? There you are, Mr Ramsey. Bring it over here, please. Yes. Next to mine. Do you know what, Mum? I've got a really good feeling about this one, you know that? What, for me? No, 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 but for uh, me, you know, no, honestly. I think for me. Huh? Look at the difference there. And this is payback time for all that grey lamb you served me for those years. <laughs> <laughs> the moment of truth. Yes. Ladies first. Thank you. OK. The proof is my... in the eating of the yeah. pudding. Yes. OK, there you go. Uh, good luck. Good luck. I think you're going to need it. No, I think okay. you'll need it.